Good evening, America. Mike Marini, your favorite presidential candidate, after a long hiatus of two weeks, coming to you this evening to talk to you about border security yet again. So apparently the uh, governor of Texas has placed, is placing some buoys along the Rio Grande River that make it difficult for people to cross. And critics of this, of course, are saying it's going to cause people to drown. Last time I checked, you have to enter water in order to be in danger of drowning. So, yeah, this this makes the water crossing more difficult naturally. Of course, that's the idea. And these buoys aren't like hidden. They're not camouflaged in any way. They're certainly not invisible. So now people are willfully entering the water with the intent to illegally cross into the United States. And there's an obstruction that if they encounter it could be dangerous to them. Yeah, that's them assuming the risk. Okay, we can't coddle everyone and just say we have to make it easy to come into the United States so that people don't die. Well, you know, we're allowed to defend our borders. And, you know, this may not be the best idea. Um, I don't really have a problem with it. It seems logical you put some sort of barrier in a place where people are crossing helps prevent that. Um, I'm actually mortified, though, that the uh, Justice Department is, like, trying to sue to get that stopped. It's like they're, not only are they negligent in their duties in protecting this nation, but they're actively preventing you, well, actively preventing states from taking steps to defend their borders. Now, I mean, this would be a little bit different if it was, like, you know, Texas setting up a barrier to prevent people from Oklahoma uh, or Tennessee from entering the state. Okay, yeah, that's an issue. But foreigners, no. And again, members of the media typically conflate the issue of immigration versus illegal immigration. And they are two separate things. So, yeah, we have controls over immigration, but when you have people just walking across the border or claiming asylum when they're captured as they cross the border and then they don't show up to their asylum hearings. So basically you set an appointment for them to say, hey, we'll make you legal if you can justify it, but then they just disappear. <sighs> anyway, it's been a long two weeks, short two weeks really. I, I, it, I wasn't on vacation, but it kind of felt like a vacation. Anyway, I hope this video Find you well, like, subscribe, and share. Maureen 2024, your favorite write-in candidate who's trying to get on the Republican ballot. God bless America.